What's up, everybody? Welcome to the place where you are always first because I am always last. What's going on, guys? Today, we are finally finishing the video that I recorded over a year ago. I decided to finally jump on here and go ahead and put it all together. So this, today we're gonna look at where my jewels are starting at. I'm gonna run through a crown jewels pack. That's the full pack. That's the $20 pack, the $50 pack, and the $100 pack, making $170 for a full run of crown jewels. And then we're gonna see where we're at after the entire pack and see how far along that kind of gets you. So this is where we're starting at. Not that many jewels in here. I do have some jewels in my gear already. Also, this is not the point I'm at right now. Like I said, this is a long time ago. So, it's progressed a lot. I thought it was good back then. Now I realize it, it's not that great. But, starting off with three legendary jewels in my Bumble Helm. That's a good start. Let's see what else we got. We're going for our mix set right here because I'm trying to get the, the all three of the attack jewels. So we got the one legendary and the two epics in the firewall plate. Let's see what else we got in here. Let's go to the dragon talons. We got the two epics and the one legendary. Good, 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 good. Going good so far. What else? We got the frostwing greatsword. All three legendary jewels. Can't get better than that. Let's go on to the next one. We'll go to my Codex, which is what I was running at the time, which is one Legendary Infantry, and then two Epic Duels in the Codex. And then we'll go to the Three Cups, which I know everybody says, don't make Three Cups at the same time. It's horrible. Well, we got one Blue there and two Epic. All three Epic. And all three Epic. Good start, good start. And yes, I know everybody says don't make three cups at the same time. It's worked out well for me. I've done it. I mean, if I was gonna build another account just like mine, I'd probably do it the same way as well. Um, just because I like to get the heart out of the way first. So I'm gonna build, besides champ. Now I'm getting into champ and stuff like that, but I never thought I would be. But I never started out with easy pieces. I never went for the terror vials. I never went for blight rings. Those pieces were just never my style. So let's get in here. Let's buy the $20 pack. It's 30 jewel, 30 legendary jewel chests. And it got, has eight of each of the attack jewels that you want. So let's go ahead and get that pack first. And then we'll get the second pack after that. 3,600 gems coming with it and a bunch of other stuff that you don't really care about. So let's go ahead and boom, boom, bang. Payment successful, got that one. Now we're gonna move up to the $50 pack which comes with 60 of the legendary jewel chest and 32 of each of the attack jewels that you want and then a bunch of other stuff that you don't really care about. The little chest here and there, I mean, they're nice but they're not gonna make that much of a difference when you're spending $170 on jewels just in one go. Uh, those chests really don't, I mean, it's cool, whatever. And then we got the $100 pack right here, which is the 130 jewel, legendary jewel chest. And we got 64 of each of the attack jewels, cavalry, infantry range. Those are the main jewels you're gonna be using for your mix set. Uh, those are the only jewels you're gonna be using for your mix set. So you wanna get those up to epic, legendary, and throw them in your, throw them in your gear. Um, nowadays, I mean, you gotta have a really good comp and you have to have really good gears. Um, you have to have really good jewels and you have to have a really good account all together. Otherwise, if you get hit by some of these max players, I mean, it doesn't matter like back in the day where you could just have decent stuff and a nice troop comp. It's not the same anymore. You get hit by them and you're taking, you know, 5 million reds and that's not a fun feeling. And so let's go, in, go ahead and go in here. So let's go ahead and dive right in. Let's get these uh, chests open up, see what we get. Let's go over here. Let's get these small ones out of the way real quick. 
Oh, actually, you know what? Let's check out the jewels now before we open the chest. See how far just the common jewels that we got from those packs gets us up. So that's too epic right off the bat. That's not too bad. So now we'll go to the nymph, bring those up. One and a half, eh. Go ahead and go to the calf, bring that up. Looking at another one and a half. All right, so we're working our way up. One and three quarters. We're working our way up. I'm guessing from these chests, we'll probably get a couple legend, uh, couple legendary in the end. Uh, it's hard to get legendary drops. We all hope for it, but you know, it, it's not always the case. So let's open up these extra chests that they gave us, see if we get anything good from them. Um, nothing I need from Griffin at this time. Um, let's open up the worm chest and nothing. Oh, legendary jade orb. Did you guys see that? That was quick. I clicked it quick, but it was there, which is good because that is one of the pieces that I am working on at this time in the game was my coronet. So we'll go ahead and upgrade that now because that gave me my sixth legendary to bring the coronet up to a legendary coronet. So let's go ahead and move those up. Boom, upgrade it. Come on, gems, gems, gems. We're not gonna wait a day and 20 hours to upgrade anything. I don't even know why they put that option there. <laughs> that should be just for the free to play gear. And then all the pay to play gear, gear is just automatically, you have to gem it. But let's go ahead and jump back over now to the chest and continue with that. Okay, terror chest, come on, let's get those seeds. We like the jewels too. Take some, take some terror jewels, they, they help. All right, two terror jewels. Let's go guard chest, anything, uncommons. Yeah, this is a, you know, every once in a while in these, in these chests, you get, you know, something cool, like that legendary jade orb, jade orb. that's a pretty good drop. Um, I wish I was getting some more, some more brains. I love a legendary brain. Still need one for my skull crusher at this time. Well, I need a few. Um, but yeah, they're a little bit harder to get. Uh, then when you get in a champion gear, it's even worse. <laughs> you thought you thought the drops were bad back then with these regular chests. These are good drops. Four, four common. That's not too bad. Now when you get in the champ chest and you don't see any out of all your champ chests, uh, kind of starts to feel sucky. But then all of a sudden, bam, you get a good drop and it makes up for kind of all the crappy drops that you had got previous to that. So it's kind of a give and take. Sometimes you win, sometimes you lose. That's just how it is. Let's open up the shiny surprise. Eh, it's whatever, a few gems. Bon Appetit. I love any halos. Any, any color, I don't care what it is, I'll take the halos. If I get a halo, it's been a good day. All right, got a few stars there. Chest of Splendor. Okay, a few gems. Any legendary embers? That you might get off of five chests. You see it sometimes. Uh, not this time, but sometimes. Let's go 20 at a time on these. Let's try, see what we get. Anything? Rare. At least we got a couple rare. It's better than getting nothing. Got a few common. It all adds up in hand, guys. Let's open another 20 real quick, see what we get. And rare again. Oh, three rare Calvary. That's pretty good. That's not too bad. And then we got some commons again. All right. Let's open up another 20, see how we do. And what's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? Oh, epic. Very nice, very nice. I wish I see some legendary here. It'd be nice to, you know, show during the video because you you do get them sometimes. Not all the times, but you do get them. So I don't, I don't want to scare you guys off thinking it's always just going to be, oh, there's another epic. Nice. It's always going to be epic and rare and uncommon and common. No, you do get the legendary too. Just not as much. But the day that you get them, you're happy. And why don't we just finish the rest of these chests off just all at one time, see what we get. See if we could get that legendary. And can we get it? No, nothing. We got some rares, two, two, two. It's 
some uncommons. All right, and a bunch of comments. Cool. I'm all right with that. Let's go into the cabinet now and see uh, see where exactly we got to. All right. Let's move these up. And we'll start with the range. Move it up. Oh, we already got a legendary there. You can see that. And one legendary. One and a half. All right. All right. Let's go to the infantry. I tend to do better with infantry jewels. I don't know why. Um, we got one legendary there. But if you look at my gear, um, when I'm putting the jewels in, you can see that I've done better over time with those infantry jewels. Cavalry, I don't know why. I'm always lacking on the cavalry attack jewels. So that one's all finished off. Let's go to the firewall plate. Let's switch those out. Get those purple ones out of there. Let's get some legendary ones in there. That will put us at one legendary cavalry for the firewall plate. Let's throw that in. And then let's get that epic range afterwards out and switch that out with the legendary range. And then we'll have full legendary on both of those pieces so far. Okay, range, there you go, and it's in. And then let's move on to the next piece now. What else we got, what else we got? Firewall plates, that's looking nice. Go down, dragon talons. Okay, so we could switch out none of them. Yeah, we got the infantry. Oh, and we can we actually can switch out the one range jewel. Oh, blue, blue. Let's get that blue out of there. Let's switch that out with the infantry. And then go ahead, put that in there. Right, let me check, make sure nothing else ahead of it needs anything else. I like to go in order. Uh, so I could just work my way down um, so I notice right away what's missing and in, in which piece but it looks like those are the only ones that my infantry needs work my infantry attack jewels need work on and just like I said I'm normally much higher on my infantry attack, attack jewels than the other two um, as you can see the only thing that needs the infantry jewels now is my cups Whereas the other pieces, they all need cav and range. So, um, well, you can see it right there. Look at the infantry compared to everything else. We got six infantry jewels legendary in the set. And then we got three cav and three range. So definitely need a push on those cav and range. Um, looks like I didn't switch out those three epic at the time, but Oh well, I probably saw it later and threw it in there. And stats are looking decent. Look at that, 450, 456, 415. That's not too bad either. You kind of rarely see it so evenly balanced. Normally uh, you'll be lacking a lot on the calves. Um, and that's where my talents are at. And that's the gear at the time that this video was made. So this was my video about the jewel chest. Um, Sometimes you get great drops, sometimes you get okay drops, sometimes you get garbage drops. Um, but I mean, you play long enough, you do it so many times, eventually you'll just build them up and eventually you'll work your way up to those better jewels. It just takes time. Um, unless you're gonna max it out right away, but then you're also maxing out your credit card. So, just takes time, just work your way on up. Just like I'm doing here, I'm way further ahead now than what I was back back then. I can't even fathom the comparison from then to now. It's way different. Okay, last but definitely not least, if you enjoyed this video, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and remember, you are always first because I am always last.